Hey everyone, how's it going? My name is Alex and welcome back to the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. Before we get started, I just want to say thank you so much for all the amazing support you guys have been showing for this series. It really, really is blowing my mind away how many people are really, truly loving this series. And you know what? Because of that, guys, I'm going to try my best, like I said, to do this on a daily upload around 6 p.m. Eastern Time. But you guys have been, again, showing tremendous support. So I truly appreciate that. And if we can go ahead and try and reach 200 likes, that would be absolutely fantastic. I know you guys can do it. You guys have been showing tremendous support. So let's see if we can reach that 200 like goal. But without further ado, let's get started in today's episode. In the last episode, what we did was we actually worked on this blacksmith area, which many of you have been saying looks quite good in the comment section. So I'm glad to hear that. We will be doing some minor details to it a bit more in the next few episodes or during a live stream and such. But so far, everyone was saying, you know what, it's coming along well. I got some mixed reviews about keeping this tree some people said keep it because it adds a little bit of detail to it and some people said take it down so right now my mixed feelings is I'm gonna keep it for now and if we don't like it as the time goes on we can always remove it but I think it adds a little bit of character to this room so you know what for now we'll keep it but we're definitely gonna be doing some more things like removing that dirt wall over there and replacing it possibly with stone and really adding some more volume and texture so that's the goal over there but yeah guys I'm really happy with how this is turning out and like I said in the last episode we need to come up with some ideas Ideas with what we should do with these storage rooms many of you guys have been saying armory uh, food storage and uh, having like certain blocks in certain levels of the storage room so where we're gonna make this place right there which you see is going to be a food storage room and I think that's a perfect way to do it because as you guys can see there's some more structures down along there which we're gonna have to come up with a few more ideas for that as well so that's what we're gonna go and work on we're gonna grab some basic stuff whatever we need right here and we're gonna skedaddle out of here and go ahead and start working working on that because that's what we're going to be doing in today's episode of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. But guys, I am really loving the progress of this world. You guys have been saying my buildings are getting better in detail, so that truly is fantastic to hear. And yeah, guys, so this is what I added. I added some more structures around here. It's I, th I think you guys can see it's coming to life. Um, and I'm really going with the same structure theme throughout this whole world for now because I think that's going to complete it really well. Eventually, we'll add some more things like market squares around here. Actually, that's a good idea. I think next episode we're gonna make a little market square uh and it's gonna look pretty cool like maybe for trades having some villagers in there that could be something i might want to try because there is a villager farm somewhere around here. i think there is i'm not certain i have to look around uh but yeah so these three buildings are going to be replicated alongside even more around here so i think it's a cool idea many of you guys have been saying we should make some of these like an enchantment room but like i said i need some more ideas for these buildings as well so go ahead and let me know in the comment sections but we're gonna start working on this place because because as you can see, I filled up the second level. We are going to make this a second level, uh, or two two floor uh, building, because I think it's gonna add some more space to it instead of just having all that open space up there. So that's what we're gonna do. And I have some idea of how to do the stairs. I thought about it, and I think it could be quite cool and and a little bit different. So like I said, my inventory right now is really really messy, and you know that's kind of just partly my fault. I'm horrible when it comes to like keeping things like uh, organized, but I'm gonna try. After we get these storage rooms built, I think uh, my organization will get a little bit smoother, hopefully. But what I have in mind is actually having stairs going from both sides of the walls. So it might seem a little bit weird at first, but I think it looks, I think it will look pretty cool. Let, let's give it a shot. I'll show you what I mean. We're going to use the spruce stairs and we're just going to kind of block up. Uh, and I think we're just going to make it one stair instead of two, two stair width. I'll show you guys what I mean. But I think... This actually could look kind of cool. And over here, we should add the spruce flooring. So I think that's okay. I don't I don't mind it. Um, we can even finish it up around here. Actually, hold on. I just thought about this. We could even close this up all the way and just have it one one closed area to walk. Or just It doesn't make sense what I'm saying. Just ignore what I just said. Just Let's just continue building these stairs because, like I said, sometimes when it comes to building, I can just, uh, just say random stuff and it doesn't make sense. But look at this, guys. Honestly, I think this is kind of cool. It looks different. I've never done this before where it's just like two stairs. So I could choose which way I want to just walk up here. So I think that's really cool. Um, and I'm thinking we should probably put a stair right there. But then again, this looks kind of weird here. Uh, probably what would be better to do is replace this with some 
maybe some actual oak, oak wood. I think that would be kind of cool as well. Give it a little bit more design. Uh, you know, as I go along, I always come up with different ideas and sometimes they always work for the best. But yeah, that's, oh great, that's a good idea. So every single slab that has a, a fence is going to be re removed and we're gonna put an oak uh, log over there. I think that's going to be much better. It's gonna definitely fill in this room, give it a bit of more detail. But oh yeah, that's a lot better, much, much better. Uh, by the way, I wanna get some torches as well. It's a little bit dark in that room and I'm hoping we have some type of source of light. All right, we have four torches. That should be more than enough. All right, I'm just gonna throw in all this extra stuff that I don't need right now with me. Uh, we do have a lot of it, but whatever. Uh, let's see. Let's just get rid of the stone. I don't think I'm going to be working with a lot of stone. I mean, who knows? We could be working with some stone. Uh, let's get some frames that I made. And let's see. Anything else that I possibly could need? Uh, probably not for now. Uh, let's see. Yep, nothing really. All right. So I got enough torches. I believe so. Four is definitely more enough to light up this place. So here we go. So you guys can see what's going on. By the way, someone did mention I should probably use a texture pack. Now that actually brought me kind of, uh, that kind of brought some attention and I was thinking about it. If you guys have a texture pack you would like me to try, let me know. But what are your suggestions? Should I go for a texture pack or should I just leave it de default? Personally, I don't mind default. I think default looks kind of cool. It just it just feels, I don't know. It just it comes together. I just like default. I've been using default for a while, so um, personally, I don't really mind it as much. But you know, let me know what you guys think about it. Um, so yeah, all right. So now this stair, I want it to be supported by something. I don't want it just to be kind of floating like it's supported by just that wall. But I don't know. Uh, what we could do is we could try some let's get some stone stairs let's get some stone stairs i have an idea here this could look kind of cool or it could go really bad i'm thinking stone stairs or uh cobble stairs i think maybe we should go with cobble it is turning night that's why i brought the bed with me like i said everywhere i go we're going to have an emergency uh sleeping bag we're gonna call these the sleeping bag um it is turning night so let's go to sleep what are you talking about there we go all right we're good to go all right, let's get this rest up in here, and perfect. We're going to leave that sleeping bag right there, um, and all right. So what I wanted to try, actually, is this. I think that looks kind of cool. Yeah, that definitely is much better. All right, yeah, that's I definitely approve of that design so far. Let me know what you guys think, and then we could add some, maybe some oak like that, and it could support from the top. I don't know. Maybe that's just too much. Maybe that's just too much. Let's see. Let's see. Let's just close this in. Let's add a stair over here. Let's see, do we have any more? There we go. Oh, we have plenty. There we go. So I think, personally, this doesn't look half bad. Now, I'm trying to figure out if I should maybe have these oak kind of supporting like this. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. You know what? I like that. I think that's cool because it kind of, get, like I said, it's always nice to have a bit of volume. And I think this adds a little bit more volume to the build. So I like it. I don't know what we're going to do with the empty space, but so far... I am pretty happy with this design. So I'm going to keep it like this. I'm going to keep it like this. I like it a lot. So that's good for me. Uh, what I also want to do is we're going to have to start adding windows. I don't know what that was about. Uh, but there we go. Let's, we're going to start adding some windows. And I think that's good. Yeah, okay. I like it. I'm pretty happy. So I think I have some windows in here uh, somewhere. There we go. And I want to get some wooden uh, trap doors. And I think that's everything for now. But I also want to possibly add some more chests on the second floor. But before we do that, I did get these item frames so I can actually place them on the chest. Now, I was thinking I'd like to get some uh, uh, comments down below about how I should add these item frames. Should they be on the chest or should they be kind of on the side like this? So the whole idea is I want to have an item that represents what is in that chest. Now, then again, I was also thinking, so there's three options. There's having them on a chest or there's having them on the side, or it's actually having this whole row of one block. So that item frame would stay above and pretty much say that's gonna be like, for example, cobblestone. All three of these chests will have cobblestone. That's just an idea. I think it's better than just having uh, an item frame over each chest and then kind of making just enough space just for one item. Now, I don't know, that's just an idea. I'm not gonna fill anything yet in today's episode because like I said, I'd really love to get some feedback on how I should organize the item frames and the chest. So like I said, here are the three options. Each chest have an item frame on them and also having specific items in each chest or they should be the same thing but the item frame will be on the fence post or it will be above the three chests and all three chests will share one item that's all in common. So that's something I have in mind. Uh, so far, me personally, 
I'm liking the item frames above the chests. That's just me. I think it looks better. So for now, that's what I'm going to do. But I'm more than sure that I might change it if many of you guys decide that I should do it a different way. So like I said, let me know in the comment sections. That's going to be a big help for me. But so far, I'm happy with this. And uh, if, it, if it turns out that we're going to change it, that's no big deal. We'll, we'll definitely work for that as well. And uh, I was thinking of adding a window there, but I don't want a window there. All right, let's see. I think it's time to add some windows on the second floor. Now, should I add... I don't know if that looks good. Actually, that doesn't look too too bad, does it? Let's actually take these down, and let's uh let's do something cool. Let me actually put furnace. Oh yeah, that's nice. All right, that's cool. I like that. That's a good design. Uh, major major key approve of this. Let me know what you guys think. But I think that's much better. Uh, definitely completes this room a little bit more. All right, cool. I like that. All right, so we definitely need a lot more chests for this room. But uh, with that being said, I did put a lot of windows up here, not expecting to have a second floor. So with that being said, because this is going to be a second floor, we might have to take down some of the windows and fill them in, which reminds me, I need to get some of the blocks for it. There we go. Let's get some of that. Let's actually get some more. So uh, just thinking about it, we might want to take down all the windows on the side of the building, which are these, which I personally think is not really a bad idea. Uh, I think it's okay because we can definitely add some design on the outside of the building so it doesn't look too plain. But this for me is okay. I like this. Uh, now here comes another idea. I'm trying to think if I should have three window or if it should be blocked like this. I think this doesn't look bad either. Uh, so I kind of want to... Let me see. Let's go down here and check it out. So this right here, for example, is two window. Should we keep it the same like that up there? Two windows? I don't know. Oh, actually... Nope, I figured it out. I know what we're going to do. We are going to make it like this. Here we go. So it's not going to be the bottom that's going to be blocked off. Because as you guys saw from the bottom, it's actually the top that's blocked off. Like this. So that's what's going to be blocked off. And the windows are just going to connect from down here. That's perfect for me. I like that. That's good. I also want to get some clay pots and add some flowers up here to give a little bit more design as well. And now we can put our trap doors. Here we go. Oh, I messed that up. But whatever, it worked out in the end. Here we go. And some right here. Perfect. All right. I'm liking this. Uh, I'm trying to also think if I should do anything up top here, if there should be any other design. But personally, I think we're fine. What we could do is we could add some spruce uh, fences going alongside down here. I think that's kind of cool. We'll definitely do that, actually. Uh, I usually go with the design more recently. If you guys notice at the docks, uh, I actually added this uh, fence post going down from the roof. It kind of looks pretty cool. Adds a little bit more design to it, as you can see down there. It just looks cool. I think it looks good. Um, it's just something I've been doing more often and it's something that I think is part of my style that I'm going to develop hopefully. So, uh, let me know what you guys think about it. I think it looks cool. Nothing against it. So, uh, not holding back on this design. All right, perfect. Uh, let's go back down, see how it looks from a distance a little bit, kind of get a feel for it. But, uh, you know what? I'm liking it. One thing I do possibly want to change is I need to add the, st uh, stone brick stairs up top as well. So, Let's see if we have any. We only have four. We're going to need to make a few more, actually. So let's do that right now. We have some extras here. Let's, make, let's go ahead and make some stone brick stairs because I want to pillar up here and fix that because that should be same thing as the top. So I know we're going to mess this path up. Oh, we can't. So uh, we're going to have to pillar up from the side then. So let's do that. All right. Perfect. That's good enough. And let's jump. Don't mess up. Oh, that was actually pretty good. GG, Alexon. All right. So uh, it's supposed to be like this. Yeah, this was the missing puzzle right here. This was the missing piece that needed fixing. Now, with this side, it's going to be bland. It's going to be plain. We're not really going to do anything with that. But for the front, it's going to be more detailed. Uh, and we will do some other things, of course, with the sides, probably adding some other type of thing to it. But I don't know if I should keep uh, those stone brick stairs on the side. Let's see. Did I do it here as well? All right. Maybe I'll just keep it on this bottom floor and keep the top simple. I don't know. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of that, but uh, I'll probably change it up in the next episode. Let me know. I think maybe it's too much. Maybe the front should just be the stone brick stairs. But again, like I said, definitely let me know in the comment sections. Let's go ahead and make some more uh, chests because we do not have enough for the upstairs room. Do we have any extra wood just chilling around here? Probably not. All right, so let's just go ahead and take all the oak. I don't know. What do I have more of? Let's just use the spruce. Let's just use spruce. There we go. And let's just make a few extra chests. I always mess the, making the chest up. I always put something in the middle and it just doesn't work out. 
but how many do we have now we have 17 we are going to need definitely a little bit more so let's go to, oh no that's jungle wood that's rare uh not really rare i mean we're right behind the jungle over there but uh we're definitely going to work with some jungle wood so that's something you guys should look forward to and that being said actually what should i do with the jungle wood uh what should i incorporate it in a build for should it be like the flooring i think flooring would be kind of cool for jungle wood so um that's something I might try. Now, where the heck did I put... Okay, 19 chests. That is definitely not enough. All right, let's just go crazy and make as many as possible right now. Because uh, we're definitely going to need a lot of them in the other rooms as well. So, there we go. That should be more than enough. 35. All right. We need some slabs. So, let's get some of this here. Make them into some slabs. And that's good enough. And now we have some oak. Do we have the oak? Oh, no. Did I waste all the oak? No, we didn't. Okay. Wow. My inventory has never been this messy for such a long time uh i actually disagree with that it's been messy the whole time so uh all right let's go and take out everything we don't need that should be good enough all right there we go and when it comes to organizing this place i'm not gonna do it <laughs> during the episodes because that would just be a lot of work but i am think i'm gonna organize them off screen or during a stream that's something i might do but yeah guys this second floor here is looking fantastic so we're gonna do the same style and i think it might be one chest short I think we have one, two, three, four, four chests, and we have one, two, three, four. Oh, okay, we're good. We're about even, so that's good. Let's see. Is it matching up? Yeah, it is. I think it's matching up. All right, cool. I like to have it all, all like, uh, matched up kind of. Actually, mm, I don't know if it is. Let me, let me go with this design here. Let me figure it out quickly. I think that's the way we're supposed to have it. Now, the only issue is then we can't put the fence post. So, we're going to have to make it a little bit different than from the downstairs room. So you'll see what I mean in just a second. We're just going to follow what I did on the first wall here. Um, and we're going to give some more space for where the stairs are and make it one one block space between this side. And a lot of you guys have been asking about the seed as well. The seed is down below in the description. I forgot to add it, so I do apologize about that. I'll make sure to add that from now on. Uh, that is my bad. So from now on, it should be in the description. And the coordinates should also be in the description. Uh, but yeah, I'll let you guys know if that's not there. Uh, let's see. We have eight spruce. We need some more. So we're gonna have to make uh, Let's see. Do we have any more? No. All right. We're gonna have to make some sticks All right, we got a little project to do here We're gonna have to make some more sticks and we're gonna have to make a lot of Fences right now. So let's go ahead and do that uh, Let's get the spruce. There we go. So I believe it's spruce on both sides this time I don't think I'll mess it up. There we go. Good job, Alex and you didn't screw it up this time All right, perfect it's turning night again. Time to get some rest. Uh, let's go. Let's do that. There we go. Perfect. So yeah, I'm making a lot of progress. I'm pretty happy with this. How this is turning out. Like I said, we still have some more to design around here, and we'll do that in the future episodes. That's for sure. So uh, let's go ahead and put these fences down. And I think the oak is going to. The only difference here is the oak is going to be a little bit weird uh, because we do have a tall roof here. So, like I said, design could be a little bit different, um, but I think we can work with it. So, the only difference, what I meant here, is the oak actually connected to the ceiling. While over here, it will not. So, hmm, I don't know. Uh, we'll definitely have to figure out what we'll do with it. But for now, we're going to give it a test and see how it looks. So, what we're going to have to do here is we're going to have to put, I think, a dirt block so we could just place it. Do we, did I remove all my dirt blocks? Uh, looks like I did. So we'll just use clay. So we'll put the clay right above it so that we can actually place the oak log like that. There we go. I think that's how I had it downstairs. So we should do that same here. Here we go. Perfect. All right. Nice. Now, obviously, this is going to come down. So we're not going to keep those clays above there. It doesn't look bad. It looks a little bit weird, but we're probably going to have to eventually change it up a bit. Uh, maybe if you guys have any ideas, I will definitely consider them. But like I said, it, it's not that bad. Let me go back down here and see if it's the same. Yeah, it is. Okay. So yeah, it needs a little bit of help, but it is fine. It's really not too bad, actually. Just the, the ceiling is a little bit difficult. I might even just close it all off. So it's just one level. So you know what? That could be the solution to this whole issue. So yeah, it looks like that's what we might do because I do have the space to do that. So that's what we're going to do, actually. That's a good point. You know what? We're not going to have this open ceiling feel. We're just going to close it up, make it like a like just a flat flat uh, ceiling. So that should be the solution to this issue, and I think it'll look kind of cool because I don't think we need this open space up there. Let's go ahead and give that a shot and see how it looks. Hopefully it's okay. I don't know. We're going to give it a big shot. It's going to be a 
big uh, test right now. If this doesn't work out, then, uh, well, rip. We're going to have to take it down. But I think, yeah, this is a much better idea. Because I don't think we even need the, the roof to be that open here for us. We just want to keep it a little bit flat. So this, for me, I think is a good uh, fix fixer up right there. So I'm pretty happy with that. All right, so we're getting close to the end of today's episode. We did a lot of progress so far with this building, and I think it's coming along really well. I'd really appreciate to hear what you guys have to think about it. And also, more importantly, let me know any other feedback and suggestions on what I should do with the other structures I actually just built right across this building. Uh, I want to know because I'm thinking of, you know, of course, adding some more storage buildings around here. And uh, anything else that I ask for feedback, make sure you guys go ahead and help me out. It does go a long way. Any feedback really helps out a lot. So, wow, we're really running low on spruce. Uh, let's go ahead and use it all then. Uh, we're going to have to do some more chopping for wood eventually. But I think this was a good idea to close this all up. Uh, so, so far we're making some, some solid ideas, some solid changes. And I'm pretty happy with them. I'm pretty pleased. I think it's good. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's much better. The windows are a little bit low. But, you know what? I'm not really going to complain about that. It's not really too bad. See, that's what I think I should have done, maybe. It was to put, actually, the, the windows one block higher. Maybe that's what we will do. Uh, so, with that being said, we might try that in the next episode. So, um... Yeah, that's probably something I might fix maybe off screen as well. But let me see what I could do with this here. We can keep the windows. Yeah, I'm definitely thinking, you know, we could probably take these down and fix it up by adding the uh, white hardened clay like this. That's much better. And then up top here, we're going to add the windows. There we go. That, I think that's a, a better choice for us. So, yeah, there we go. Much better. There we go. Perfect. All right. Yeah, that's a lot better, guys. It really completes this room. And we still have some more to do on this house. I mean, it's never easy to complete one house in one episode. It does take a lot of time. But uh, you know what I also want to try is we could just go for something a little bit simple. Try to almost complete this look here and not keep it so weird looking. So what we could do is we could just continue it all the way to the end. Yep, like that. And then over here, we're not going to be able to add chests. But what we could do is we could maybe just add like one chest possibly. I think one chest wouldn't wouldn't hurt us. And we could add a trap or uh, wooden trap door like that just to hold it. And then we could add our fences just to continue going down. But the thing is, if we go up here, could we get back up? No, we can't. So what we could do is we'll just leave one fence post like that. And I think that that doesn't look too bad. I think that's okay. I, I like that. It's a little bit different. It's taking, it's using a bit more of the empty space. And you know what? I don't think it's too bad. I think it's okay. Um, and other than that, I mean, I'm pretty happy with how this turned out. It really come, it came along a long way from where we started with it. So I'm trying to think if there's anything else I should do for this room right now. Obviously, we could probably add some more chests here, but I don't want, want to really rush anything. I was thinking of just closing it in with some fences like that, but I'll leave it like that for now, but obviously I don't think I'm going to keep it the same. Now, like we said, this is where the oak, uh, planks go. So what we could do is I don't have a lot of, oh, I do have plenty of oak. I want to actually try and continue that pattern. Just continuing back up here. I think that would look kind of cool. Uh, so let's give that a shot. Let's continue this design. So it's like from here. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. I like that. And then right here is like the stairways that you just go in. So that's actually kind of cool. I don't mind that. And what we could do is this here could be stairs. And I think I could mold the stairs into here like really nicely. So let's see. Yeah. Oh, okay. Perfect. All right. That's what we'll, we'll do. I think that's a big upgrade. Definitely looks a little bit better. So I'm pleased with that. We could definitely add maybe some fences like this. And, uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. That's pretty much it for the top here. We're probably going to do some more designs, probably. But uh, so far, I am pleased. Uh, just doing a little bit of detail right now myself, just adding some more design to it. You know what would be cool? Let me actually just put a block right there. Let's jump up here, and let's connect that right there. That would be kind of cool. So let's see how that looks. We'll jump over here as well. And let's see. Perfect. I think that's kind of cool. I like that. It looks a little bit like it's uh, connected. It's supported. So that to me is good. And I think everything we've done so far has been pretty positive. So I'm pretty happy. This probably will come down, actually. I'm not really a big fan of that. Without further ado, uh, yeah, that I think is going to conclude today's episode of the Minecraft Survival Let's Play. 
I'm pretty happy. I'm pleased with how everything turned out. Uh, I think we did a lot of progress, and uh, I think we're going to do some more in the next episode with completing the whole entire uh, storage room here. Maybe having some uh, chests filled in. I think we're going to do that during a stream or something. But uh, as for now, we're just going to leave it like this. And uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy with this, guys. This is this come along a long way. So let me actually add this up here, too. Uh, that I think will look kind of cool just to complete that look and maybe even something there But I did mess that up. I think it's the other way. Yeah, it's the other way. I don't know how that happened. There we go Let's see. How's that look? Uh, yeah, you know what we could definitely do that. I think that's fine. And there we go That's pretty much it. We could definitely probably add a quick uh, trap door Let's do that. See how that looks like a trap door right there. Yeah, you know what? That's we're really taking it to the extra level here guys with detail uh, So I'm pretty happy with that. There we go Perfect, and I don't think we should add, which we can try, but I don't think we should add stairs right here. But let's give it a shot. I don't think it's going to do any harm. You know what? That really does complete it, so I'm pretty happy with that. Let's do the same thing up here. Let's add these trap doors. Perfect, and that should complete this whole look. I'm pretty pleased with that. So, uh, all right, that's a good... That's a good ending of the episode. So like I said, if you guys enjoy, make sure to go ahead and hit that like button. And also, don't forget to go ahead and follow the Den MC, which is a server I own. Our Twitter and Instagram is down below in the description. That's a quick plug-in right there. So make sure to go ahead and check that out. Give us a little follow. And uh, when we reach 100 uh, followers, we'll definitely do a giveaway for a rank. But yeah, guys, this is much, much better. We're going to fix the, those windows over there. Like I said, we, we did adjust it a slight bit, and it looks a little bit weird right now. But we're going to fix that up. But this room really is taking shape. I'm pretty happy with it. So if you guys enjoyed, definitely go ahead and hit that like button. Other than that, guys, my name is Alex, and peace out, and stay foxy.